So EA dropped the Max 87 base icon upgrade. Let's open up a bunch of these packs and hopefully get some decent cards. If you guys are looking for cheap, fast, and reliable Ultimate Team coins, check out MMOEXP.com. Link in the description. Save 5% using code HABER. These are the best cards in terms of value. Coming in at 1.1 million coins, we've got Torres, then we've got Zola, Essien, Zambrotta, Makalele, Petit, and so on and so forth. There are some very decent cards you can get in this icon pack. But there are also some not great cards. I think someone usable, even if it's just usable for a month or so, would be good. Obviously, you want Torres or Zola or someone like that. Zambrotta would be very nice too. Let's see who we get in our guaranteed icon pack. It's a walkout CDM from Spain. Is that Xabi Alonso? I think it is. Eh, he's about 250k. I don't mind it. The reason why I don't mind it is although this card's quite slow... He has got some really good passing play styles. And with the way this game plays, having him at DM with sort of, you know, holding plus or deep line playmaker plus plus with long ball plus, uh, it's he's not awful. He's probably usable. He's about 250k. I bet this card's actually not bad in game. So I'll actually take that. Although, not what we're looking for. Let's see if we can get a W in our next pack. All right, we've got a Lumi Fox next. We're going to do his uh, team of the week pack first for good luck. For good luck. No walkout. Maybe we got rid of the bad luck. That's what we're trying to do here. We're trying to get rid of the bad luck. Jonathan David. All right, come on. We've got the goat hat for a reason. Can we get the goat, Fernando Torres? I don't know if anyone's ever referred to him as a goat before, but I have now. Who have we got? Centre mid from England, Frank Lampard. He's actually not bad. He's worth nearly 400k. I don't really know why either. Well, I kind of do. Power Shot Plus is nice. The card's actually pretty decent in terms of stats, right? Um... And to be honest, he's got some decent play styles, like really good passing play styles. He's got dead ball specialist as well. Uh, he's got Travella. To be honest, box to box plus plus. This card's actually nice. This card's actually real nice. I see why this card's nearly 400k now. That card's like a Valverde regen, even though he was probably playing football before Valverde, Valverde was born. But like, that's nice, actually. Low key, I actually like that card a lot. All right, next one. If you guys do open this pack, by the way, let me know in the comments down below what you guys get and leave a like on the video if you guys do enjoy. That's also not bad. That's Campbell, who is worth over 400k. A little bit better than Frank Lampard. I'm going off the list that we showed you earlier, by the way. He's actually one to the left of Frank Lampard. That's not bad. About 400k. Uh, usable, absolutely. Uh, 81 pace, 87 defending, 88 physical in this stage of the game is solid. Um, that's a decent card, to be fair. We'll absolutely take that. All right, Bro wants Vidic. He's got the Man United badge. He's already packed in Bappe this year, by the way. He's got some insane pack pulled cards already. Maybe this is where the pack looks at. We want Vidic for him. Who is that? That doesn't look like Vidic at all. Who is it? Centre mid from England. Another Frank Lampard. I mean, we'll take it. It's a shame that it's going to be a, a player we've already had before, because I'm not the biggest fan of getting duplicates. But... We'll take Frank Lampard. It's not bad. It's That's probably like the, the mid-range, you know? The top end is obviously the Zolas and Torres and whatnot. That's like the mid-range. It's like 350, 380. We're taking a quick break to open up Dario's 2.5k point pack real quick. Let's see what he gets. It's an Inform. We have a new team of the week, don't we? Is that... Who is that? Inform Bunny Shaw. Fair enough. I actually don't know who's in this week's team of the week. Genuinely, I have no idea. Um, well, I know Bunny Shaw's in there. I think Graham Hansen's in it as well. Erdegaard and Buddy Shaw. What rating is she? 87. Good fodder, I guess. Apart from that, it's not great. Who else have we got in there? Any good danglers? Hergberg, Beth Mead, Little. A lot of walkouts. A lot of fodder, to be fair. But no one that you get really excited about. All right, Southern Medal's on the Xbox now. Let's see what he is going to get. Will the Xbox give us better look than the PlayStation today? We're about to find out. Who is he getting? That looks like Sol Campbell again. He just has a massive frame. No. Oh, Veron. Veron's a bad one. Veron's a bad one. He's only just over 100k. Um, that's not a sexy card at all, is it? He has got incisive pass, which is OP this year. And he's X United. Aside from that, and not what you want. Right. Dan's pack. He's a Leeds fan. Who is that? Larson? Oh, he's not going to like that. It's X United, isn't it? That's X United. He's a Leeds fan. Henrik Larsson's card looks okay. 87 pace, 86 shooting, 82 dribbling. Like, that does not look like a horrific card. He's about 160k-ish. It's not the worst. Oh, he's gone. See you later. All right, James is packed next. Let's see who James is going to get. These aren't as exciting as they used to be. Back when we had base, mid, and prime icons, these were a lot more exciting because, like, you had base icons, like, well, it wasn't on. Like, Hullet or Vieira, they were 86 rated. Like, and they were great cards to get. Gattuso... 
He's not completely awful. He's about 160-ish K, roughly. Uh, he could definitely do a job at CDM. Sometimes maybe good. Sometimes it may be a bad word that I can't say. Um, but, like, he'd probably do an alright job at CDM for, like, a few weeks. But he's going to get swallowed up by the power curve pretty quickly, I think. Right, we have got DS Kofi on the PC next. Let's see if the PC look is where it's at. Is that another Larson? I just see the hair swaying. I assume it is. Yeah, it's another Larson, unfortunately. Not what we're looking for, unfortunately. But could have been worse. Could have been... Uh... Cliver. <laughs> All right, we've got Anthony's Max 87 base icon pack now. Let's see if he's going to get the first Torres of the video. Here we go. I can't tell you who that is. Left back. Ooh, Ashley Cole is not bad. You take that 450,000 coins for this card, roughly. Um, and he's a good left back. This card, will, this card will do a job for you at left back for a, a solid chunk of the next few months. You know what I mean? Next couple of months. Full backs, you don't need like the best cards in the entire game. You don't need to go and get Theo Hernandez. Oh, a walkout in a 50k pack as well. Bruno Fernandez, nice. Like, you can make do. Like, Ashley Cole will, will do a job in your team for a while. And he gives you a link to all your players. So, that's actually a good one. Like, Zambrosa and Ashley Cole are both decent. And that 50k pack, low key, is a very good 50k pack as well. Look at that. That is uh, nice. All right, we've got Matt's pack next. He's a United fan. So, actually, United would be nice. Who's this? We've got ourselves a striker from, ah, from Wales. So good, they named a game mode after him. We get Total Rush, Ian Rush. Oh my word, that is rough. That is absolutely painful. Especially as a United fan, you don't want to see him there. Poacher Plus Plus. He's got some nice play styles, but like, just not what you want to see. He's played for, he's played for Liverpool and Leeds. Like, no thank you. Essien, Zola, Torres. They're the three he wants EA, and he will buy points. You can tell because he went on the point section. Who is that? Centre mid from Ireland. Keno, Keno. Come on, Roy Keane. That is a huge W. Best one we've had so far today, mate. Best one we've had so far. To be fair. Mate, what, what have you just done? What did you do? What? What did you just do? Why did you do that? Bill just wants X Chelsea. Bill is looking for X Chelsea. That's all we want. Come on. That is Larson, who I don't think played for Chelsea. Oh, no. It's Crespo, who did play for Chelsea, I think. Oh, my God. If, if I'm wrong by this, by the way, I'm very, very sorry. But I'm pretty sure Crespo played for Chelsea. I'm like 90% sure he did. I'm like 99% sure he did. I'm going to feel stupid if he didn't. Look at me. Five years, bro. Knowledge. Ball knowledge. Get it. That's actually not a bad card. All right. Ben's pack next. Who is that? Who is that? That's a bold head, I think. Centre mid. Oh, it's Juan Sebastian again. Juan Sebastian Veron yet again. This is not what you want to see. That's not any of the five he wanted either. That is no. No, thank you. You want to see a bad hairline because like quite a lot of them have got bad hairlines. You know what I mean? Zambrotta. Campbell, Vidic, like you want to see some some boldness, but you don't want to see him. To be fair, Torres would fit his team really nicely because he's got a Spanish thing going on with his team. Um, or like a nice, like, uh, you know, Zola as a number 10 would fit his team quite well as well. Who we got? Center back. It is Sol Campbell again, who will we'll go into his team, actually. I think that's an upgrade on Bremer. So, you know, that, would, that will fit his team. I guess we'll take that. Not what we're looking for, but we'll take it. All right. Next one, who are we going to get? Ooh, I don't think we've seen this person yet. Just just from the body type. Ah, is that Ian Wright? Ian Wright, right, right. Uh, he's like 170k or so. It's okay. Like, he's probably one of those cards where he actually will finish everything. I'm not even kidding. But it's just not a really super exciting card, is it? Four-star weak foot. Like, probably got some decent finishing play styles as well. It's just... He has no scoring play styles bar the one that he has plus. Like, fair enough. He's maybe not going to be that great. All right, Matthew's pack next. He's got 2.3 mil. Will the rich get richer? Probably. Because life's not fair. This this feels like it's going to be the first one we get where we get like a 600k plus player. Just I just feel it in my bones. Left wing, John Barnes. It's not 600k plus, but it is a decent card still. Four, 500k, something like that. Uh, technical plus on this card as well. So it's actually not terrible. I think this card probably performs quite well in game with his stats as well. 89 pace, 85 shooting, 83 dribbling. As a, he can play cam as well. So as a cam, he probably did quite well. Or as a left winger. So it will take that. All right, Adam's pack now. Who is Adam about to get? 
He's got 40k points over the PA. Reward him for rewarding you. Rykard! That's the, I think that's the most expensive one so far. Actually, I think it is. It goes to show. Load up 40k points. That's how you get the look around here, boys. That is a really decent one, to be fair. He can play CB. He's got intercept plus, four star weak foot, three star skills. Uh, what's his play styles? Anticipate block, incisive pass, power shot, and Traveller. Do you know what? And he's got ball play and defender plus. That's a nice card. I can see why he's so expensive. That's actually a real nice card. Six foot two, mostly lengthy. That's that's the best one so far. That's also just a real nice card in general. He's like 500k. We take that. Next one. It'd be hard to top right card, but you've got a great card if you can. Is that Sol Campbell again? Yeah, I could tell by the frame. Just a big stocky lad, isn't he? Just a big stocky lad. Um, can't complain. It's hard to like, there's nothing much I can say about that. I just can't complain. It's a decent card. Right, we've got Dan's pack on the Xbox. Let's see what we're about to get. I think this is pack number 25. Let's see. That looks promising. Perez. Perez is all right. Finesse shot plus can play cam left mid. He's actually not bad. He's like three, 400k, I think. I actually don't think that's a bad card at all. I know I sound like I'm being positive about every single card here, but that card probably fits the meta quite well. He's like six foot one, something like that. Um, finesse shot plus, some decent play styles. I think that's okay. I actually think that's okay. All right, I'm going to rip open the Ready Set Rush Pack on my account now. What are we going to get? What are we going to get, EA? That doesn't look promising. It is a walkout. Striker from Norway. It's Hergerberg. That's not promising at all, is it? Irene Paredes and Hergerberg. That is not promising. I was hoping for a special card, to be honest. Any danglers? Rolfo, Schuller, and Madison. It's good for fodder, at least, but... That's just not that promising at all, is it? Yeah, that wasn't worth it. All right. Here we go. Sean's pack to end off today's video. If you guys have enjoyed, please make sure to leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're new around here. We're ending off with an Ian Wright. I think we opened like 26 packs today. 26, something like that. So, you know, a little bit more than usual. But uh, but yeah, we didn't do, we didn't get a Torres, we didn't get a Zola or anything like that. But we did get ourselves some half-decent plays here and there. Let me know what you got in the comments down below. Subscribe if you're new around here. And I'll see you later.